42 Dream Team, it's your boy D Neil back with another reaction video, guys. Here we are with Fat Pizza Season 1, Episode 4 Crime Pizza. Before we dive in, make sure you subscribe, ring notification bell, give the video a thumbs up so it gets suggested. What we got? Yeah, I like Fat Pizza Pizza. They're big in their cheese. And in breaking news, the Premier today announced tough anti crime laws. And due to the violence on our streets, a new law came into effect this morning. We're calling it the Homeboy Law. Mm. The police have been empowered to detain and search anyone wearing T-shirts, loud running shoes, and certain baseball caps. Oh my God! It's on the streets. These politicians. <laughs> that he just explained Polly. <laughs> He just explained Polly, mate. I swear, Bobo, mate, they treat us public like suckers. You know, I've been working the streets for 10 years. What violence is out there? I don't know. <laughs> God damn. Don't forget to log this attack in the attacks on the station house logbook, all right? Yes, Sarge. Oh, oh, but Sarge, uh, I just remembered the book's full. So, uh, where do I find another one? Look, the budget cuts don't allow for extra stationery. Just write it on the wall next to the phone. Hey, Bobo, it's that most wanted show, mate. The guy who robbed us, he's, uh, he's coming on in a minute. Welcome to Australian Most Wanted. I'm Ian Plimpton, and tonight, a very special episode. Soon we'll go live to Central Prison, where we'll witness the first hanging in over 40 years. Oh, wow. Thanks hanging? to you lobbying our politicians, the death penalty has been successfully reintroduced. Dang! The death penalty is the best legislation the government ever put in. Scumbag. Serial killer and pizza shop robber Reginald Bandini has been terrorising Australians for 13 years. And now, he has only 15 minutes to live. Ooh. Right now, our own Edwina Borrell is outside his cell. Edwina? Well, Ian, not all is going according to plan. Apparently there's been a problem with the delivery of Reginald's last meal. And he's very upset. Hang on, the food just arrived. G'day, mate. Sorry I'm late, bro. I to fill up petrol, mate. Okay, so we're waiting now for the food. It's being passed through, through to Reginald. This is the last meal he will ever eat. <laughs> His last meal is a fat pizza pizza. <laughs> I guess pizza ain't a bad last meal, dog. I would choose steak, but pizza ain't a bad last through, meal. Get through to Reginald. This is the last meal he will ever eat. What the f is this? And get the f off me, man. He doesn't want like it. Seafood, man. There seems to be a bit of a seafood. problem here with the topping. The goat cheese. Says goat cheese here, mate. Yeah. I mean, it's his last meal. I mean, what difference is it going to make? Hey, Sleek is a meal. I want to say, uh, hey, to Larisa uh, but, uh, and Teresa. His last meal and, uh, here Anna, on the death row. And uh, my mate Habib, it's my birthday. Yeah. Habib? Yeah. <laughs> Thank you, boy. I'm going to kill you, man. Thank you, boy. Bobo, why took that order, mate? It wasn't gay cheese. You know, it was a seafood. <laughs> yeah, Bobo said that's what he did. Oh man, what's with this guy? Oh my god. What what's wrong with you, mate? Need injection. Oh bro, you got oh, you got chocolate breath, man. What's Ooh. wrong with you? It's making me sick. Diabetic. <laughs> Need my insulin. <laughs> Inject me, please. Oh, I'll give me that. But where? <laughs> it's the stomach. Oh my, it's that bad. The breath is that bad, dog. That he throwing up. Hey, Abib, did you organize those strippers for sleek, mate? Of course I did, you lad. What do you think I am? Cost me a fortune there. I can't believe 
How much it costs for strippers these days? Mm. But I, I can't wait to see his face, huh? It's gonna be so funny. Turn her up, will you? Welcome back to AMW. In recent weeks, you may remember updates regarding the infamous syringe bandit. He's been caught many times on video surveillance, robbing convenience stores around the country. He wears a red bandana and uses a blood-filled syringe as his weapon. <laughs> if you see this man, police advise you to proceed with caution. He is extremely dangerous. <laughs> a blood-filled syringe as a weapon, dog. He's like, hey, you don't want my blood injected in you. You know what I'm saying? I got this. Hey, you don't give me the money, you're going to get my blood in. You're probably going to die because I all kind of diseases in this blood. All right, hey, hey. I've got this guy outside. He's got the diabetic. I'm going to put the injection. Come on. Can you help? I can't do it. you got to help me. Come on. God dang. Uh, what seems to be the problem, officers? Homeboy spot check, sir. Would you mind stepping out of the car, please? That car, he set this up. It was Habib, wasn't it? It's my birthday and you're the strippers. Usually he picks horrors, but uh, let's party. Oh, my God. Oh, shoot. Now, let me get this straight. You want to give me 12 grand to knock off a pizza delivery guy? That's right. <laughs> what do you do to you? Forget your pineapple. <laughs> it's a long story! Oh, my God. Oh, <laughs> I remember this. <laughs> it is the whole marriage dog. I can't believe that you've got this meat pizza. You know I'm a vegetarian. I'm sorry. Look, that's it. I, I don't want to be married to you anymore. I've just had it. You're, just take this pizza and just shove it up your ass. I've had it with you. Janet, I love you. Go away. Go away from me. I love you. Dang. Come here. Small. <laughs> My wife. Oh my god! So mate, where'd you get my number from? From your ad on the internet. Oh yeah, fair enough. You got a photo of this bloke? Oh my god! Syringe thing. I'm no bandit. I'm a pizza man. How's this, Claudia McPherson and Roger Connery? You know the 007 guy. Look at them, mate. Look at the way she's doing it. Oh yeah. Oh my God. Time, the cameras. The cameras are all over the place. And I'm the one that's in charge of security. <laughs> I don't want to make a fortune selling this on the internet. Fuck, oh, look at the bounce, look at that. Why have kids all around? Oh, he's happy too. Oh my god. Hello, fat pizza poot. Mama! What? What's the matter? Bobo, those are homie boys are outside of the house. They're gonna take my money. They're gonna kill me. Up next, homeboys that kill you in your own home. <laughs> homeboys that kill you in your own home. <laughs> okay, Mama, I'll close the shop. Okay, relax, Mama. Close your doors, I'm on my way. My car! Super Solomon! Uh oh. Hey man, I just realised 
My dad owns the factory that makes these. Ah, uh, <laughs> that dad's a dog. Look, just because we're rich and well educated doesn't mean we can't steal cars and take smack and stuff. <laughs> what a bully. And the best thing is, even if we get busted, we've got enough money to get off. Listen, just before we start, I'll, I wouldn't mind, you know, if you sign this for us. Well, what is it? Oh, it's just due to staff cutbacks. I've got to play both roles. I've got to play good cop and bad cop. <laughs> so just sign it back and initial as well. Just here? Yeah, yeah. Ta, ah, thanks. Listen to you, comfy. I'll get you a little pillow. A cup of tea. No, Orange pica. One sugar. No, but... Milk. A little pillow biscuit, you know, with the mince inside. No, nah, look, I just wanted to say, look, with that thing with the syringe guy, I had nothing to do with that. You know, look, there bro, was a diabetic... Bro, bro, I'm with you. I'm wrapping. I'm right in there. <laughs> you like the Yeah. Two tickets to the grand final. I've got a few one. If you want, two tickets on the halfway line, right next to the bar. Grand fun. Yeah. yeah. They're yours. Okay. You comfy? Oh. Yeah. Can't get you anything? None. Listen, I'll be back in a minute, all right? Just one minute. Let me know if you need anything. Sure? Yeah. Promise? Be <laughs> <laughs> a little weird. A little weird. Good night, Bill. Uh, Rich. What role are you playing at the moment? Bad cop. Started out playing good cop. Must be trained to thought. Might have to go into the cells and bang a few heads, I think. <laughs> they gotta play, but they gotta play both roles, dog. That's crazy. The department's so broke. Everybody that worked there gotta play. You gotta be good cop, you gotta be bad cop too. How you gonna be good cop and bad cop? <laughs> it ain't possible. Be good cop again. These bloody cut bats are giving me the f mate. Yeah, I was playing good cop now, I've got to go back in and play bad cop. Yeah. <laughs> Can I borrow your phone book? Sure, mate. Thanks, Bill. Yeah, oh my god, he's been a little All right, you f little Now listen to me, you piece of <laughs> You get hold of that phone book. Get hold of the phone book! Now. You know what to do with it. You know what to do with that book! Man! Left! Right! Left! Get the shit out of yourself! See? It's a paper thing, man. Hey! Oh! Nobody moves, man! Well, they get stitched! I'm the Serene's bandit, man! Give me your fing money! Get it to me now! Oh, yeah! Come on, don't eat here, huh? That's it, you! You drug taking little. Beatable <laughs> police. I stole this car so cops wouldn't hassle me. What seems to be the problem, officer? So, Wibbs, if you're talking into a mobile phone while you're driving, I'm going to have to find you $300. Can I look at your license, please? Dang. Officer, I wasn't on the phone, I was on the microphone, mate. I was rapping. Are you trying to get smart, you homeboy punk? No, no, I'm not trying to be smart, but I'm a rapper and I was rapping. Three, honey. Nah, I can't do it. Can't pay it. Now we will have had pizza paying them. Can't afford to make that payment. On the microphone, it's my birthday and I was just rapping in that, you know what I mean? Look, uh, I'll show you, mate, you know, you can bop away. You cops are overpaid, under work, never get laid. Nah, but I will, because it's my birthday. The rapper says here on the car door that you're a pizza delivery boy. You know it's offence to give false information to the police, do you? Hey, yeah! Oh my god. <laughs> oh what my are, lord. What is that doing up there? I don't know. Roger, that is us having sex up there. <laughs> Roger, it's us having sex, for God's sake, do something about it. All right. 
It's my worst angle. And look at the light. Do I look bad? Do I? Does my bum look big in that? What the f is that up there? Where's it coming from? Man, it's it's straight off the internet. I look like a f***ing size 14, don't I? I just love it when they look like they're enjoying it. Oh, Roger. Oh, shovel it in, mate. Oh my god. What am I watching now? I'll never get a cab. Mama, what am I gonna do? Bobo, Bobo, come with the mama. Where are Just an update. About 15 minutes ago, Guido Hatsunukas' ice cream van was stolen from outside his very own home. He's with us in the studio now. Guido, hello. Hello, Ian. Guido, can you tell us what really happened? Well, I saw some crazy man steal my van. It's my job. Without it, I can't feed my extended family. And the <laughs> Prime Minister he puts on the GST, and the flight path is making my family sick with the noise. What sort of <laughs> steals an ice cream truck van? <laughs> I'm coming, Mama! <laughs> Man, the pizza's cold. Bobo. Bobo's gonna be spewing. I've been in there for what? It's about two hours, you know? That's it. Keep putting yourself up, you And then they tell me that they caught the real guy while I was in there, you know? <laughs> I swear, first thing tomorrow morning, I'm calling Amnesty International. They'd be interested in a case like this. Yeah, man, these new homeboy laws suck, mate. Man, the cop has just fined me, bro, 300 bucks for my new Nikes. They cost me 200. Hey! Hey, mate! Mate, my hot bag, the pizza's not even worth stealing! Come here! <laughs> What's going on? Man, this homeboy just stole my hot bag. Ooh. Come on, mama! Come on! God dang! Right, man, what you got to do, come down to the police station and fill out one of these uh, stolen hot bag reports. Otherwise, Bobo will dock you, mate. All right, man. I'll see you back at the shop. Oh, my God. God dang! Bubba run it down. Everybody, dog. Everybody get it. Look at that. And Bobo thought I was a stude getting a bulletproof hot bag. <laughs> Hello, is this the police? Yes, listen, I've got a problem. They're putting photos of me and my boyfriend having sex on the internet. Look, point two two calibre. I'm sorry, there's no way. We can't spare them in. We've got a few emergencies here going on here around the station. No, there's no way. Sorry, what was your name? Guys, shut up! We've got a supermodel in trouble. Oh my yeah. god. What? I need you to come down here now with all the men and lots of guns and lots of, you know, those hats. I want them all wearing those hats. <laughs> come on! What the f do you think you're doing, mate? I'll stick that on of your f ass! Do you want to go to your boy? Come on! Uh oh. Ah! I'm coming, mama! Hey, are you sure you ordered them strippers? Oh my god. I ordered them, but I forgot to pay for them. <laughs> don't worry, don't worry. I've got a top ID. <laughs> hey, you listen to me? Yeah, what? What is it? My uncle? Yeah. He's got a fake credit card. Yeah. We use that. <laughs> yeah. I call him now. Yeah. Oh my god. Guys, guys, listen, listen. Shh, shh, shh. That's an homeboy music. Right, time for payback. Ah, dang. Now you're better with glocks. Treat us like my criminals, cause some make more than they ever will. Illegally. Uh oh. Okay, ho, 
microphone, boy. We've got you surrounded. Put the microphone down now! I only came to report a backstone. If you don't want to hit, it's cool. I'll just keep rolling. Drop it now! I know you break walks next, cause you get no sex. We get your girls and even get your chicks. If you don't cease your rubbing, we'll be hey, back to shoot. Hey, sleep about to die, dog. Sleep. Put the mic down. Sleep. Put the mic down, my boy. Mate, I don't know what this is about, mate. It's because I'm ethnic. But, mate, you can't. It's the millennium. I love bro. I've been straight for two years. <laughs> Let's get it. Go, go, go. Ah, day. Oh my god. Yeah mate, look, they're beating the crap out of him. Yeah look, I'm recording on Digicam at the moment. We can sell this with the Claudia video, which I've already posted that on the net. Heaps of hits mate, heaps. Look, it's under the site www.claudia.com. You like that? Claudia's that's unreal! Hey, hang on, I've got another call coming in. Hello? SBS Security? I've planted a bomb at SBS Studio and you're sitting on it right now. Yeah, hang on, mate. I'll just get my bomb alert form. That documentary on the Republic of Vladimir, it was biased! Yeah, look, wait. When is the bomb going to explode? I'm not going to tell you anything except you're all going to die. Look, this is serious, right? <laughs> where did you put the bomb? Do you think I'm a f***ing idiot? I'm not going to tell you where the f***ing bomb is. You're all going to f***ing die. Yeah, listen, mate. I'm just going to have to put you on hold, OK? Jesus Christ, mate. There's a f***ing bomb in it. <laughs> hey, listen. I've got another bomber on the line, right? Look, I'll get back to you later. Maybe we'll do dinner or something. Yeah, yeah mate. God. Ah, day. I can't believe it! He's still alive! I paid him 12,000 bucks! Yeah. 12,000 <laughs> bucks! What's going on? It's closed. Where's Bobo? I better f do this myself! Uh oh. That sound. No way. Mama, <laughs> what's the matter? How can you so long? They nearly kill me. Oh, but Mama. Shut up, you face, you no good son. If it wasn't for this nicer man here, I would be dead. She was lucky, mate. I catch these blokes trying to break in. I hit him with a couple of uppercuts, mate. Left rip, mate. Right cross. <laughs> Never a copper in when you need one. God, day. That's who took your car, Bobo. So, how did you find him so fast? Oh, we got a tip off from the TV show Australian Most Wanted. Oh. Now, we normally wouldn't let a civilian come along on a job like this, but. Uh, considering the Commissioner and the Premier are big fans. It's been okay. Oh, really? Do you think I can have a gun? Oh, anything for you, Miss McPherson. Oh, thanks. <laughs> <laughs> hey, y'all about to get hit with this bomb, man. Everybody about to die to this bomb. Yeah, what do you want? Uh, can we come in, mate? Yeah, right, eh? Let's get it done! Well, we're back, and what a night it's been. We've executed one serial killer. We've caught the syringe bandit. We closed down an internet porn ring. And we caught a cop-killing homeboy. 
Oh, it's really a great piece of work, isn't it? Yeah, it's been a fantastic night. And apart from the few police shot earlier, it, uh, it really has been a top night. And it just goes to show that the homeboy laws are working a treat. Yeah. Oh, oh my God. What did you pull me over for? Step out of the car, sir. If you want my licence, I've got it here. It's clean. Here, take it. Just get out of the car, sir. Look, OK, I'll admit I don't have a receipt for the stereo, but I swear to God, it's not stolen. You're in big trouble, Sleek. Oh, my God. That's right. I am Sleek. <laughs> released and sued the state government for brutality and wrongful imprisonment. The case yeah. has been organized by Amnesty International. Security guard Bruno Saker was found guilty of pornography and pedophilia. He was sentenced to 400 hours of community service. Bobo Gigliotti was found guilty of improperly operating an ice cream delivery vehicle. He was fined $10,000. Oh my God! Tony Bono was given a medal for bravery and has been dating <laughs> Sofia Gigliotti for two months. Claudia McPherson retrieved the stolen images and was given copyright to the footage. She plans to write a book about the experience and the video is currently selling over the internet. Of course. Of course. <laughs> That's all we got, y'all. Make sure y'all subscribe, ring notification bell, get a video a thumbs up. Shavoy Dinia, out.